Welcome all gamers to another Mid Sussex YouTube video. You're here with your host Sam and almost proper host now, Chris. I'd say so. Yeah, you've been yeah. on as many videos as Tom. And um, we have Chris, and we also got a special guest down to the end, Luke. Hooray! And you're a member of Upfield Ball Gamers. Oh. Yes, we've been playing lots of SBG today. Um, so we thought we would do a quick unboxing. Uh, today we are unboxing Militia, Lake Town Militia. Um, Lake Town Militia Swordsman. Lake Town Militia Swordsman with axes. <laughs> um, here's a pack we opened earlier. Uh, obviously, if you're a kid, get a parent to use a knife. You don't rip them with scissors. Um, there you go. Look at that one. Now, I'll start with this one. Um, oh, so, this one here. I quite like this pose. He's got an axe. This is going to be fun. Um, they come in three pieces, as you can see, the torso, the shield, and the body. Um, there's quite a lot of flash, um, and that axe is a bit bent, you might want to straighten that. Yeah, I'll do that later. Yeah, these are actually Chris's. I bought them for him as a Christmas present. Um, yeah, I mean, the casters look pretty good. Yeah. Um, there doesn't see, apart from on the weapons, there doesn't seem to be no, it's only the axe, it? that much flash on them. This this guy's very good. They look very pirate like. Yeah. Well as Bill Webb puts it, they are seven hundred angry fishermen. <laughs> um I kinda yeah. like this weapon. It's kinda like a axey thing. It's an axe and a pick. It's an axe and a pick. Double piercing strike. Yeah. Um D6 defence down. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's got very good detail on his face. Come on. So is this guy. Yeah, they, they are very detailed. These are some of the best fine cast ones I've seen. Which one haven't I done yet? Wow. The guy with the sword. Yeah. yeah, the only guy in the blister who has an actual sword. <laughs> Actually, that's a good point. Yeah. Even though they're called swordsmen, in their rules, they don't have a sword. So you can equip these guys with axes, flails. Um, let's get back at this guy's face. Very nice. I love their wicker basket shields. Yeah. <laughs> this guy's got like, the, like, it's got like a hatch. Off a door, yes. Off a door. <laughs> Just ripped a bit of door. Um, so yeah, what, what what do you think of the models, Luke? Um, Sorry, but I'm dropping them. Uh, yeah, they're good. Um, they're not my favourite from the range, but they are just good late time militia models. Yeah. There's not much to say about them. No. Really. Except that I wish they were cheaper. Oh, God, yeah. 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 A Horde army at five pounds a pop. <laughs> yeah, I am. Um, I know a few people who have gone for a full six hundred point army of militia. I won't say any names because he asked me not to. <laughs> um, I, I, I think two warbands would be my max with sort of Bard and probably Alfred. Yeah, but Alfred can't need them. But he'll be around. He'll be around. <laughs> yeah, I'll have a captain or something. Yeah, I do like the captains. Or, yeah. Captain, we give him a bow. Um, that, so their stats. Looking through the. Oh, no, that's way. no, you can't have a bow. You can't have a bow. Yet, Percy, the fisherman in Battle of the Five, has a bow. Yeah, oh, he's yeah, like Bard's that, captain. Yeah, he should yeah. have been the captain model. Yeah, well, that would have been awesome. Six. Which is weird since his Bard can't be. Yeah. <laughs> Can <laughs> just I steal the shield? If you're yes, Bard. steal the shield. Um, yeah, I mean, the the militia are very, just a very basic profile, aren't they? They're just. That they're goblins, in essence, yeah. with an extra courage. Um, they're, they're designed so that you take Bard. Yes, yeah, they're 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 very very much designed to to fight alongside Bard, who I have. I bought him. I made a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I saw it in IMAX and was like, oh. I'm sure it's a mistake I'll make tomorrow. Yeah. Um. I, mean, I would like to do an army of Lake Town militia. But when I'm doing, you know, when you're doing Wrath of the Elves and Cumberbads. Yeah, they're not anyone's really priority. Not no. a mainstream priority. Really. But then, you know, I mean, well, I picked up a blister yesterday on the off chance to go with Bard. Although I highly doubt three are going to be much, have much use in game. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, so, yeah, it's, it's not yeah. a great deal to say. No, the. the they're pretty, they're pretty useless. They've been made to be take... Smaug fodder yeah. and Gundabad fodder. Yeah. 
But saying that, if you've got a lot, a lot of them, then it'd be like just throwing like goblins at people. You know, you just whittle them down with numbers. Yeah. You know, because they can take spear, shield, and bow. And what's crazy is their defense four, which is the same as Merc with elves who are in armor or heavy armor. So give them shield defense five. They are quite durable. Um, and obviously you've got Bard, yeah. you've got Banner, Fight 3. You, you basically just put a line of late time militia supported by elves or a line of elves sort of supported by late time militia. Or, fight five. well one thing I've kind of been thinking, ooh, doors opening. <laughs> <laughs> what, what was it? Two lines. And we're back in the room. Dinner requests. Um, yeah, what, where was we? Uh, what I was thinking of doing, you know, in an ideal world, is you have a warband, you know, your bard leading 12, like shields, and then you have the master with 12 um, Lake Town Guard, and then yeah. you can basically up their fight value to three and four. So obviously the master can yeah. up that up, up, up their fight value for a might point, and then you use Alfred how he's supposed to be, and um, give the master might yeah. back. I'm not sure that won't last after game one. No. Start giving it to Bard instead. Yeah. <laughs> and, and Thrandor, I'm sure he'll do that as well. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Super Thrandor with six might points. <laughs> Gives me chills. It does, yeah. Oh, it but then awesome. equally, on the subject of Alfred, I've, I've seen, you know, guys go, right, I'm going to three will on Thrandor. Will. One, one, one. <laughs> oh, no, Thrandor's got no might left. <laughs> He's only got Alfred with four might points running around. Thranduil doesn't even need mine. So. No, Thranduil. <laughs> but this isn't this isn't about Thranduil. This is about Lake Town. Yeah, we're, we're getting sidetracked. So we're, we always get sidetracked. I've noticed that in our videos. It's because we've got the profile in front of us. Yeah. Oh, let's talk about oh, look, that. It's more Dealing. interesting. Dealing Keeling. Yeah, I have them. Look, look for them in an unboxing soon. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So I think that is probably as much as we can say. Um, yeah. You know, the models are great. The cast look good. Just are what they are. Yeah, they they're, they're just. Nothing they're special. Just, they're just bods. Um, but go out, support your Hobbit hobby, buy lots of them. Because they do look good. They do look good. They are fantastic models. So I've bought three more for a painting project. Um, I would like. I like the Bowman. I think the Bowman are very cool. It's just mm. that because they're not in because they're direct only. I can't mm. go into GW, into GW and Impulse buy those. It's a great show. It is. Um, so, yeah, I think we'll. Um, I'll end this here. Um, I can't remember the GBH, GBHL. Goodbye. Uh, no, I've seen it a million times. I can't remember. Yeah, sorry guys. Do you do you support your hobby hobby? Yeah. Um, <laughs> don't forget to support your hobby hobby. Like us on Facebook. Yeah, like us on Facebook. Follow us on Twitter. Comment, like, share, and subscribe. Yeah, that one. That's, That's a good one, one though. Uh, yeah. I don't think they do that anymore. Don't they? What? Mm. Mm, maybe. And uh, happy strategy battle game, guys. Yeah, that was the key. That's the key one. <laughs>